Good morning. So today is Jan uh, June, sorry, the 29th. It is a Monday. I'm about to check into my coach, just weighed in. Um, my weight's a bit higher, but the beauty of this coach is it actually takes your average weight over the week. So it doesn't matter if you have a sudden spike or whatever, it really doesn't matter. So the most important thing is actually to weigh in every single day. So the coach has a great like running average and knows your weight. Um, so I was 191 as you could see, but actually this week on Thursday I um, hit the 189 mark. I was under um, for the first time in this cut under 190 uh, pounds. So that's great. New milestone, obviously I had my refeed, 3000 calories, so the uh, weight just went up and that's okay, you know, that's normal. Um, and I'll be back down the next few days when I'm back on normal calories like today. So I'm gonna show you today, run you for a full day of eating 2300 calories. Um, yeah, just ride along, come join me. Um, I'm currently in semester break, so I'm a bit free. Just gonna go gym, gyms are open again. Fill my gym, go for a walk, maybe groceries, I don't know. Not much really, just chill. But I will show you my meals, 2,300 calories, here we go. All my macros planned out, just gonna scroll through them quickly. So for breakfast, I'm gonna have an omelet with, you know, I put in all the ingredients, so green pepper onions, one egg, 150 grams of egg whites, salmon, um, protein powder for my protein coffee. Uh, snacks, you know, Oreo cookies. Um, that This one, the Oreo cookie stick, that's an ice cream. That's an Oreo lolly. Um, yeah, uh, 90 calorie fiber one bar. Cocoa Pops, that's going to be nice. And that is lint 90% chocolate for them fats. So if you want to hit fats, like just literally pure fats, and you want to do it in a fun, you know, nice way, have chocolate. Look at those macros. All fat, basically. Better than putting butter in your food. Um, then for lunch, just a sandwich with uh, lean beef mince. And then dinner, mac and cheese, uh, pumpkin soup, two cr free crackers, actually. And then with salmon and chicken. And night snacks like the usual, just Greek yogurt, mixed berries, and cocoa powder. Simples. My calories on point. Well, fats, just one um, less than I should have, should have, but that's fine. Close enough, pretty close. Not gonna eat yet, but first things first, get some liquid down in me and some vitamin C. First things first, beauty of flexible dieting is that I, I can have whatever I want. I just feel like it. I get my staples in, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and you know, like my kind of evening dessert, and boom, I can fit in whatever it is that will take me, like reach my macros. So first things first, I just feel like an ice lolly, so I'm gonna have one. It's breakfast, but it doesn't matter, you know, I feel like it. It's just carbs and fat, basically. That's how you look at things. Oreo ice cream. Don't you hate it when the tea bag falls into the tea? Look at this. What the hell? Good. Amount of salmon. Ah. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna go um, go buy some now. For God's sake. Okay. See you guys in a bit. And I'm back. Oh my God. So no salmon. I had to get some stuff, and then I realised I had chicken as well. So I need to get a bunch of stuff. Here we go. Go get chicken breast. 
breast. And then, just the staples today, nothing interesting. Uh, pink yogurt. Some tissues from over. Get your wine out of the gutter. And let's do this. In the car now, let's hit the gym. Pool day today, legs and back. Let's do this. A few moments later. Did a bit of a walk, on my way home now. Gonna cook up some sick lunch. And then, I'm gonna walk to uni to return some books and actually get some groceries later. But um, yeah, that's it. Uh, gym went well, all good. Um, Nothing much to report, to be honest. Um, all good. Got a PR in squat section, 140 kilos for five. And yeah, um, oh yeah, there's one thing. The snacks I have today, I didn't record because I've just been munching them through, through the day. Just got back. Sorry guys, I was gonna say before my battery ran out that um, I've been munching through my snacks all day so I'm not necessarily gonna show you them unless I just happen to be at home. So I might show you my little cereal thing later but I've already had my ice lolly, the um, not ice lolly, the ice cream. Um, I've had that, I've had, what else have I had? The popcorn bar, I'm gonna have my apple later so yeah I'm just gonna go to uni. I've got I've got a part-time job actually. I'm auditing and I'm transcribing. It's like a work from home job, so it's pretty good. I've got I'm doing that quite occupied with that at the moment. Um and yeah, work on the website a bit and just chill a bit. Um then I'm gonna head out. So, see you guys in a bit. Just a quick physique update. Let's go. Three PM. Time for lunch. All right. Measured out my spinach. I'm weird. I like to eat spinach like just like that. You know. I actually like munching on like a lot of spinach, like salad. I don't know why I do that. Um, people do that, right? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway. Toasted bread. Five grams of butter. Bowl of spinach. And I'm gonna build my own burger. It is now 8.08 p.m. and I'm hungry. Finally, dinner time. I will show you guys my mac and cheese stir fry and pumpkin soup in a sec. Jesus, I'm gonna eat this. Then I've got to Skype my parents tonight. Every Monday, because I'm living like away from them, uh, I I don't Skype. But I mean, like I go on WhatsApp and talk to them. Anyway, I have my call them. So yeah, I've got to do that. I'm gonna watch a bit of stuff while I eat, and then cap it off with my protein yogurt dessert again. You see I'm eating so much food in the evening, that's because I like to save my macros until the evening, I like to save my calories so that, you know, 
I'm satisfied going to bed. So it's all worth it. Um, if I blow all my calories for my breakfast, I can have like a 2,000 calorie breakfast. What's the point in that? You just get hungry again. So that's why I do it. So brief explanation of what I'm eating. I had, so it's just literally powder soup. It's so easy. It's just carbs, only 100 calories, like easy peasy. I'm not one to make things from scratch. Although I try to eat whole foods. So I did a stir fry with chicken stuff and I added it, which is what I always do. I do it a lot of the time, so I have some, you know, easy to do stuff that tastes good. Like I make uh, instant noodles, for example. Today I did mac and cheese, instant mac and cheese, and then I'll mix loads and loads of stir fried peppers, onions, um, what's it, chicken. Got a bit of salmon as well um, to the mixture, and mix it all up, and it becomes a big ass dish. Easy peasy, and it tastes good because we're using the, you know. The package stuff. Alright guys, signing off. Um, it is now 10.46 p.m. and I'm having my final meal. I like to eat close to my bedtime. I sleep around maybe like 12, 12 30. It's been quite late recently and I'm trying to food, but anyway. <laughs> um, have a look. I have, I mix Greek yogurt with cocoa powder and I put sweets in it and then throw some fruit and mm, that is good. And if you've got the macros to play, if you've got the calories, you can add Nutella, you can add uh, Oreos, whatever the hell you want to it. It's like, it's like blank canvas, but that's the base and it's just amazing, low calories, low fat, high protein. It's like chocolate mousse, seriously. Um, so I'm going to have that and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is a full day of eating, 2,300 calories and... Yeah, hopefully my weight continues to drop and I can get um, the 180s consistently now because I was 189 for just literally one day. So I dipped below 190 mark, which was good. And yeah, I think you know, there'll be more 180, 180s, weigh-ins in the 180s. So stay tuned. If you like the video, like, share, and subscribe. See you guys next time.